Because directory structure varies from one computing environment to another, it's important to understand the difference between relative and absolute paths so that you can use relative paths for applications that you share. Suppose when you were a child, you lived in Raleigh and your best friend lived on Elm Street. The absolute path to his house was his postal address. He lived two blocks east of you. This was his relative address. When you grew up, you moved to Pennsylvania. You missed your friend, and out of habit you walked two blocks east and looked, but no one lived there. You may have experienced a similar problem when you moved a map document to a new machine, but forgot to move the data it's trying to point to. Getting back to your personal story, you later moved to Oklahoma. There you made a new friend named Jason, who lived in the same relative location as your true best friend. Feeling contented with your new friendship, you are now able to concentrate on your GIS work again. Suppose you create a toolbox and add a script tool named Hello. You point the script tool to a script called hello.py, which resides in C, temp, GIS homework scripts. This is the script's absolute path. The file address functions like a postal address. The script's relative path to the toolbox is two directories below the toolbox's directory. When you add a script tool to a toolbox, you are given a choice about the type of path you want to use. If you leave this checkbox unchecked, when the toolbox is moved, it uses the absolute path, meaning it uses the same full path address it used originally. This means the script tool will be broken if you share it with others and they don't have the same directory structure. It's a good habit to always check store relative path names. However, you then need to maintain the same relative path structure when you share it. When I move this toolbox, I need to copy the GIS directory to the toolbox directory. Otherwise, I have a relative path that's pointing at a folder that doesn't exist. To make things easier, you may want to get into the habit of placing maps and their data in a common directory, or placing toolboxes and their Python scripts in a common directory. This way, when you share the applications, you can just copy the directory's contents and relative paths will be maintained. It's like moving in with your best friend.